Welcome everybody to Bedbug Central TV. I'm your host, Jeff White, and in today's episode we're going to talk about a product on the market that's getting a lot of attention from uh, user forums, people who are posting on it, uh, you're hearing a lot of pest control technicians talk about it, and I have a sample right here, and the common name of this one is Mother Earth D. Um, there are a lot of different common names out here for this product, and what the active ingredient is in, in it is diatomaceous earth, or what people commonly refer to as DE. Um, a very interesting product, and you know, this is starting to fall into the quote-unquote green market where it's not using any synthetically derived pesticides to compose the actual the product itself. Um, but one thing I want to say before we get into talking about what this pesticide can do is that if anybody is going to consider using this pesticide to treat your home on your own, because this is something you can get over the counter on the internet, please, please, please follow label directions as closely as you can. Um, a lot of people view this as a very, you know, safe product, and I hate the word safe. Anything used inconsistent with how it's supposed to be used can be unsafe. Um, but nonetheless, people view it as this, this safe product. Like, you know, if I use this, it, it can't have any negative effects because it's very green. And remember that it's a pesticide, and it has negative effects on insects. And if used improperly, it could have negative effects on a human. So please, if you're going to use this on your own, please follow the label directions as closely as possible. But either way, off of the disclaimer, onto the product. Um, what diatomaceous earth is, and I'll read it right off the can here so that everybody can understand, it's Mother Earth D consists of the skeletal remains of freshwater diatoms and contains amorphous, amorphous silicon dioxide. Sounds complicated, and I'll break it down for you in very simple terms. What it is is that there's an ancient fossilized creature called a diatom, which are no longer around, and they take those fossilized remains, they crush them down, and they make the white powder that is contained within this bottle. And what you can do with that white powder is you can dust cracks and crevices in your home, again, follow the label directions as closely as possible, and what happens is the bed bug, or pretty much any bug, will come in contact with that white powder and it adheres to their, their, their exoskeleton and then it desiccates them or dries them out. And that's how a lot of dusts work that are on the market to kill insects. Is a lot of them are desiccants that dry the insect out. And of course the one question we get repetitively is, does DE or diatomaceous earth work? Um, there has been some research done on DE and some of the preliminary research does show that if it's, you know, placed inside the home properly in cracks and crevices where bed bugs are hiding and bed bugs come in contact with, you know, a good portion of dust and what exactly that means, I'm not even, you know, 100% sure, but you got to make sure you dust a crack very well that it can kill bed bugs. So yes, it does work. It may not be quite as strong as some of the other pesticides on the market, but the pro to using a pesticide like this is the fact that it is a very quote unquote green product and you know it uses natural ingredients and it, it also you know it, you can really go around your house and dust as many cracks and crevices as you can find. So diatomaceous earth is definitely a product that you know we'll recommend using and having your pest control technician servicing your home using. Um, one thing to be aware of is that DE, or diatomaceous earth, is something that's commonly used in certain types of pool, household pool filters. You want to make sure, if you are going to go out and look for diatomaceous earth on the market, you need to make sure you buy the stuff that is registered to be used as a pesticide, not the stuff that's used in pool filters. Again, you want to make sure you purchase the stuff that's registered as a pesticide. So that's our overview of diatomaceous earth. I do see it being a beneficial product to the pest control industry. I do see it as something that, you know, if a pest control company is using it in your home, it's definitely not a bad thing. It can kill bed bugs. And, you know, if you do feel the need to go out and buy some on your own and dust cracks and crevices in your house, hey, by all means, just please follow the legal directions. Okay, once again, as I've said once, I'll say it again, jeff.white at bedbugcentral.com. Please email me anything that you're thinking about that you want to hear or whatever else you might have on your mind. I'm more than happy to read some emails and respond to them. Okay, I will see everybody soon for our next topic.